This is the new Renault Kadjar. Now, strange name, not such a strange idea. It's basically their answer to the Qashqai. Obviously, the design follows on from the capture. Very Renault there with the bold badge in the middle of the grille. Down the side here, it actually looks very much like the Qashqai, this kink over here. Inside, though, once again, follows on from the capture. It actually feels pretty high quality in here. It's a nice place to sit. You've got a big multimedia screen there, and you can also get Renault's R-Link system, which is very good. It allows you to hook your mobile phone up to the car and use it to just place with the speakers. And It's one of my favorite systems that any manufacturer does. We're gonna hop into the back now. Check it out. That chair is pretty far back, but I've still got quite a lot of room here. So yeah, nice and spacious in the back, but then it should be, it's based on the Qashqai. Hopefully the boot's open. Sometimes it shows they're not. I've just got to figure out how to open it. Well, there we go, it's not so bad. If you look here, this is interesting. Flat load floor, no load lip. Got extra storage under there. And as you can see, you can remove this false floor if you need to and the seats fall down there we go flat ah. so nice usable load space practical car good looking car it will go on sale later this year price from around eighteen thousand pounds engine choices you're going to have a 1.5 litre diesel 1.6 litre diesel and a 1.2 litre turbo petrol